This was a $3 billion mistake. The Expeditionary Fighting Vehicle, or EFV, was to be used by the U.S. Marines for amphibious assault. Think M1 Abrams, but for water. It had a speed of 45 miles per hour on land and 29 miles per hour on water while transporting a crew of three in addition to 17 Marines and their equipment. To achieve such speeds, it was equipped with a more powerful engine than the M1 Abrams plus two water jets. But EFVs were over-engineered and unreliable. On average, something would fail every four and a half hours, but that's not why the program was cancelled. The EFVs may have had an impressive speed, but the US military realized that in the missile age, the EFVs would be sitting ducks. Various scenarios gamed by Marines concluded that amphibious assault could only happen at beaches where there is no enemy or where the enemy was first destroyed using precision-guided missiles before sending over amphibious assault vehicles. This realization made EFVs too expensive compared to simpler platforms that could accomplish similar tasks, putting an end to the $3 billion program.